Earlier, I came to this restaurant and found some volunteers willing to be sat in quite an unusual formation so that I can ask the question, how many chairs can I remove before the group falls to the ground? Will it be none, one chair, two chairs, or will I be able to remove more than two chairs? Hi. <laughs> I'm about to start removing the chairs. Are right, you guys ready for this? Yeah. All right, OK, right. Three, two, one. Chair number one. Yes! That is one chair down, and my volunteers are staying up. Let's move straight on to chair number two. Three, two, and a one. <laughs> chair number two. Two chairs gone, and my quartet of diners are still off the deck. <laughs> chair number three. You ready for chair number three? Three, two, one, chair number three. Yeah. That is three chairs removed, and despite a wobble or two, my foursome remained defiantly off the ground. Chair number four. Three, two, one. Yeah! So look at that. With all support removed, amazingly, all of my diners are holding their position. Give a round of applause, guys. Is that cool? Yes! That is amazing. So the answer was I could remove all four chairs without a single person falling to the ground. Do you know what you've created here? It's called a lattice structure. What's important about this lattice structure formation is that it's a geometrically stable structure where each member of the group has their mass supported by the person next to them. And this allows them to stay suspended without the help of the chairs. Give them a round of applause, guys. Is that cool? Yes! That is amazing. Right. My name's Tim Shaw. Thanks very much for coming. Enjoy the rest of your night. Good night. <laughs>